All right, it's frittata time. Always works better like this, sideways. Definitely one of my favorite things from the Dollar Tree for frittatas. Coconut oil spray. All right. We are looking at, this was garlic cauliflower in a green sauce. The green sauce was jalapeno and kale thrown into a food blender. Not a normal blender. Then blend it up. Oops, got a piece of meat. We want to save the meat for the top. All right, we'll do a quick pause for the cause. All right, that definitely took more than a minute. So I saved you a wasted video. Then we're going to push it down. Give it a nice flat base. We got some leftovers for tomorrow. We're going to do a frittata a different way. Uh, tonight, we're going to be adding 0.8 ounces of real bacon. Figured, hey, let's give something to try. Something different. We have a little hole right here. We're going to fill that. I'm trying to get somebody called the Dollar Tree to be one of my sponsors. I teach people how to do five-star restaurant food using their products. So, hopefully they're my first. But that's not a sponsor. It's rough being a YouTuber. There, that looks beautiful. Now it's time to egg it up. All right, as I'm making this dinner, I'm already thinking, all right, tomorrow night, what are we going to do? This was supposed to be an eight egg. These are medium eggs. Eight medium eggs equals six eggs, if you didn't know. They teach you that at the Culinary Institute. All right, that's 0.8 ounces. We have some bacon things planned. That's why we grabbed this tonight. And now we have some oyster and mussel meat. Covered in green sauce, obviously. We're just decorating the top of the frittata. A little bit more. Filling some of those gaps. Looks pretty good. All right, we're going to do the chef challenge. So you want to push the muscle meat and the oysters into the egg. If I was going to do something to take this to the next level, I would actually put in some grated cheese over the top. Oh, yeah. Or actually, even put it before I put the muscle meat. All right. Oop. Got a spot there we want to fill. We missed a spot. All right. There's my frittata. If it works, you'll see me do the chef's challenge. This is a very hard pan to flip in. So, 
That's why I do the chef challenge because the guy that does these pans, his name, wait for it. is Ming and he comes out with this Simply Ming line and I destroyed one of his walks and I haven't destroyed this yet. I don't do that many. This is my main cooking instrument. Over a billion people cook in a walk. So there's almost 8 billion people. What does that tell you? That this is a very efficient way of cooking. So that's why I always use a wok. All right, off to the fire. That's my dinner. Yummy. Love you.